What's up, Team T Better? How are you guys doing? So, I just got back from the gym. You know, your girl's hitting the swirl train here. I had a really, 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 really good workout. Um, so, I'm showing you a little bit what I'm eating today. So, this morning I had my tea baby cakes. Now, you guys have the full, full recipe in a separate video. So that's what I had earlier this morning at 6 a.m. And now after the gym, I am having my post-workout shake, which is just something I have to hold me over while I do some things and then before lunch. So take a look at what I put inside my shake. Now we're gonna do a scoop of my favorite vegan protein. You gotta overflow it a little bit because Lord knows we need the extra gains. And then I'm going to put in a little bit of my organic hydration blend from the Matcha Reserve. Because this boy has, um, this has beetroot, goji berries, Rishi mushrooms and maca, which are all so so good for you. So I'm gonna split it and I'm gonna do half a teaspoon of this and Then I'm also gonna put in some of my organic skinny blend which has the coconut powder Ashwagandha, I don't know what the heck that helps with fatigue and blood sugar levels and increases your muscle strength and then also has moringa which is loaded with nutrients and in reduces inflammation perfect right after the gym so then I'm going to put in half a teaspoon of that and then I'm going to put some stevia for sweetness and a handful of spinach maybe a little bit more can never have too much spinach I'm going to put some almond milk. Some blues. Wow, these... Look how huge these blueberries are. They're so big. Look at the size of these. They're monsters. And some cold, cold, cold water. Get a little bit more almond milk. And then also some cinnamon because it's really good for your um, blood and your sugar levels. Then I like some ice to make it more thicker and cold. Oh yeah. And just like that, this is my vegan Hulk shake. Mmm. You guys, it's so good. So good. And then I also like to eat blueberries on the side. Blueberries are really, 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 really good for you. They have so many antioxidants and health benefits. And by the way, I just took my antioxidant test level at this like little party I went to. And it was so shocking and amazing. I had no idea that this was like something that you can do and they like put the the meter on your hand and mine was like over exceeding so they had like one of the highest levels of antioxidants and I was like what like it was super cool it was super rewarding because I do take really good care of myself so I was like all right that's cool anyways that's none of my business um I'm going to drink my shake and go take a shower because I am sweaty. You guys, don't forget, 
this is the most one of the most important things after you lift weights and or do cardio or do whatever you do. Don't forget to drink your post workout shake or eat or whatever depending on whatever time of the day you go. I go to the gym really early so I like to just since it's still like breakfast time, my second breakfast, I like to have a shake and get stuff done and then I like to have lunch. So I'll see you then. Alright you guys, so I am back and it is lunchtime and I am so hungry. Um, I just finished filming actually a recipe for you guys, which you will be able to tell because I'm wearing the same outfit in the next video um, of a really, really good recipe. But right now I'm going to make lunch. Um, so I'm going to make my tacos for lunch um, made with my quinoa tortillas that I've showed you guys before. That is my absolute favorite um i have some already sometimes when i'm like i have a lot of work to do I, I like to incorporate my leftovers with the meal i'm making today so i already have some leftover um tempeh and jackfruit so some grilled tempeh and then still some of those jackfruit um chicken nuggets that you guys saw in my other recipes so i'm probably gonna fry that up with um some cabbage and carrots and spinach and make little tacos avocado and uh, yeah so check it out because it's super super bomb
And just like that, you guys, simple, quick, healthy lunch that I made two tortillas, my jackfruit and tempeh mix, my little veggie mix I'm going to put inside the tacos, and my avocado. And that's it. So I'm going to go eat this while I get some work done and charge my camera, and I'll see you guys soon. Alright, so I just got back from a long day, a lot of work, and I am freaking starving. So, I'm not sure what I'm going to make yet, but I know I'm going to whip something up really quick. Something not too fancy, maybe some pasta with something in it, veggies, I'm not sure. I'm going to go look right now, but you guys will see, but I'm so hungry. So, I'm going to show you all the recipe, eat, and go get more work done, and... I love you all. Thank you for tuning in to some of what I eat in a day. And I'll see you all on my next video. So I'm going to be using this from Explore Cuisine. It's organic black bean spaghetti loaded with plant-based protein. Uh, 25 grams. And then this salad on the side. I put cucumber, carrots, cabbage, um, white and red cabbage, tomato, olives, I just mixed a bunch of garbanzo beans and a bunch of veggies. So I'm going to have salad. And then I'm also going to put in the noodles some spinach in there. So some noodles and salad. And probably have another snack later. And that's that.